The inauguration of Senator Daisy Ihanire Danjima Women's Center, built by the state government to care for the needs of vulnerable persons, particularly women in the society, was graced by several dignitaries from within and outside the state. This center is the brainchild of the First Lady of Federal State, Mrs. Betsy Obaseki, who is the chairperson of Gender-Based Violence Management Committee to address the issues relating to gender-based violence in those state and help victims seek justice. According to Mr. Obaseki, the center is a with state-of-the-art facilities and we help protect women and other vulnerable persons in the society. The unprecedented increase in cases of abuse, particularly during the COVID-19 lockdown, was a wake-up call. And this led us to institute a number of legal and policy reforms. This includes the enactment of the Violence Against Persons Prohibition Law, the Sexual Assault Referral Center, the Adult State Gender-Based Violence Management Committee, amongst others. These were all aimed at protecting women and other vulnerable persons in our society. On her part, the special guest on the occasion, Senator Daisy Anir Danjuma, said the center will strengthen the institutional framework of the government of Edo State to protect the vulnerable in the state. Much as we concede that our women are powerful and strong-willed, we have seen time and again that they often fall victim to abuse, human trafficking, and other vices, which deprive them of the opportunity to live fulfilling lives. The State Commissioner for Health, Professor Obey Akoria, noted that the center will help tackle gender-based violence, which is prevalent in the society, especially against women and girls. Most of all, should be aware of the stellar roles played by Her Excellency Mrs. Betsy Obaseki in bringing issues of gender-based violence to the front burner of state and national discourse as well as legislation in the past five years. The First Lady of Federal State and Chairperson Gender-Based Violence Management Committee, Mrs. Betsy Obaseki, assured members of the public of greater productivity from the Federal State Gender-Based Violence Management Committee. Our goal is to empower survivors to seek justice, justice and healing, and to prevent further incidents of sexual violence from occurring. I want to take this opportunity to thank, express my deep appreciation to all of the stakeholders who have contributed to the realization of this project. Shortly after the inauguration ceremony, Senator Daisy Ihanire Danjuma was taken on a guided tour of the center by the First Lady of Edo State, Betsy Obaseki, accompanied by Governor Gordon Obaseki, his deputy, Comrade Philip Shaibu, and other invited guests. Patience, Osaugiwa, ITV News.